Conversation 166. Parties. On what occasions do people in your country celebrate parties? There are many occasions when people throw parties such as New Year's Eve, wedding engagements, family reunions, birthdays, etc. But sometimes people hold parties just when they meet up and want to have something fun to do. Are you a party animal? Yes, I am. I'm crazy about going to parties. I love meeting friends, drinking, and talking. When do parties often start and finish? It depends on what kind of party it is. I believe the perfect time to have a party is in the evening, from 8 to 11 p.m. Where are the parties thrown? They are held inside or outside. Some formal events like weddings slash housewarmings are organized inside while others like family reunions and birthdays may be held outside. What do you usually wear when you come to a party? I often wear casual clothes like a t-shirt and jeans if I go to informal parties and a dress for formal ones. What do people do in the parties you attended? At the party, people talk, eat and drink together. Some go there to find business opportunities and new partners. Do you enjoy drinking alcohol at the parties? Yes, a little beer can cheer me up. Do people have to bring anything to the party? It's not required, but sometimes visitors bring some gifts to show their love for the host. Why do people, especially the youth, love going to parties? It's just a good way for them to chill out after a long day. Conversation 167, a teacher. Who is your favorite teacher? I like Mr. Tom the most. He is my English teacher. Is he a foreign teacher? Yes, he's from the US. What do you like about his lessons? I have fallen in love with his American accent and he always shows us something new about the world outside of textbooks. What's he like? He's not only knowledgeable, but also very friendly. He always treats us like friends, not students. What does he usually wear when coming to class? He usually wears a gray suit when he comes to class. Do you love his subject? Yes, I enjoy English a lot. Do students in your class like him? Yes, all of us admire him. Do you want to be a teacher like him? No, although I like him, my dream is not to become a teacher. I would like to be a chef. Have you ever been punished by him? No, he rarely punishes anyone. Do you want to see him again? Of course, he's a great mentor. Conversation 168 a friend. Who's your best friend? It's Jenny. She's my best friend. What does she look like? She has shoulder-length brown hair. I just love her lovely smile. How and when did you meet? I first met her when we were in high school. How often do you see this friend? I see her every day. We're in the same class. What's she like? She's not only thoughtful, but also very understanding. She's always by my side to cheer me up whenever I'm in trouble. Do you and her share anything in common? Yes, a lot. We both love shopping and playing sports. What do you and her do together? We usually do homework and read books together. Have you and her ever quarreled? Yes, but we seldom quarrel. When we do argue, afterwards we seem to understand more about each other. Does she know how to cook? Yes, but she's not a great cook. Do your parents like her? Yes, a lot. They always ask Jenny to come over for dinner. Why is a friend important in life? A good friend can make your life better in many ways. I don't think anyone can stand loneliness. Conversation 169, a hotel. What is your favorite hotel? Where is it located? It's the Sheraton, a five-star hotel located in Saigon, Vietnam. How do you know that hotel? before coming to Vietnam for traveling, I searched on the internet. It's one of the best hotels in Vietnam. Why do you choose to stay in that particular hotel? I like the architecture there, and online all the reviews about the hotel are positive. Is it by the beach? No, Saigon is not a beachside city. Does it attract many tourists? Yes, I guess. When I stayed there, it was completely booked. What type of room did you stay in and what facilities did you get from the hotel? I stayed in a double bedroom. The room is equipped with air conditioner, a flat screen TV, wardrobe, etc. What do you like about that hotel? A gymnasium, swimming pool, and barbecue area are available. I also love the green space surrounding the hotel.
Are all the staff friendly and helpful? Yes, definitely. They all are professional. How much does it cost a night? It costs me around $250 per night. Do you recommend that hotel to friends? Yes, if they come to Vietnam. I love everything there. Conversation 170, a letter. Who wrote the letter to you? My dad wrote the letter to me when he was on a business trip. Did you keep the letter? Yes, I put it in a folder. Whenever I'm down, reading his letter would be a good way to cheer me up. What was the letter about? He told me about his new workplace and how things were there. How did you feel about the letter? I was glad to know that he was fine in another city. Do you have a letter collection? Yes. I collect all the letters from family and friends. It's one of my hobbies. Do you like writing letters or emails? I prefer writing paper letters. Do people in your country usually write letters? Years ago they did. Now people prefer emails. What's the difference between emails and handwritten letters? Emails are much more convenient than letters because they're free to send and they get there instantly. However, letters are much more special. Why should we write letters to friends or relatives? It's a good way to show love to people you care about. Thank you for watching my video. Please subscribe, like and share to channel Dance Ryun in order to get more videos. Thank you.